Hey guys, Angie Tanini Rogers, and I just got off a training with Reginald Stinson and uh, Keisha Bass, an affiliate training that we had, and I wanted to show you something uh, that they talked about in the video. I'm going to show you how to create a call to action button for your blog. So um, I'm back in my WordPress blog. This is actually an old blog that I really don't use anymore, so you might see some outdated stuff on here, but um, never mind that and just pay attention to the actual actions I'm taking in order to to um, show you how to do this. Um, let's see if I can make this a little bit, I want to make sure this is in your screen so that you see everything. Okay, so um, how you can see I have my title there, how to create a call to action button for your blog. And I did do a little keyword research to make sure that that long tail keyword is going to be something that shows up to help me rank uh, my blog post and my video that I'm doing right now on uh the first pages of Google. All right, so how to get a call to action uh, button. So first thing you're going to do is find an image for your call to action button. And so you're going to go to nur um, not nurses. Uh, you're going to go to Google Images, and you're going to um, let's think of what call to action we want. We can have buy now, download now, watch video now, whatever it is. So I'm just going to say, um, um, how about join now? Let's do join now. All right, so here are some join now buttons. I'm just going to pick one, guys. Join now. And that one looks good to go. What you want to avoid is anything that has a uh, watermark on it, with, um, it like a uh, transparent uh, see-through wording that shows like Shutterstock or some other um, – uh, name because that means that it's copywritten and you do not want to use copywritten images so just watch out for that so you're gonna right click and save the image as you're gonna save it uh, wherever you want I'm just gonna put join now red button alright so that is saved and now I'm gonna go back to my post you're gonna go to um, add media and you can see I don't have that here so I'm gonna upload files I'm going to select it from my computer wherever I just saved it and I said join now so we're going to go find that join now there it is you double click it to open it up then it's going to load and then what you want to do it's right here uh, what you want to do is make sure that the title uh, you can you can name it title it uh, something that has to do with um, your keywords but you need to make sure it's relevant you can't just name it cat dog mouse uh, because when it someone searches cat dog and mouse in Google your red buy now button or join now button is going to show up and they're going to know that that's not um, related because nobody's going to click on that for a cat dog or mouse okay so uh, red uh, join now call to action button and then you can do the same thing with um, the, the caption actually you don't necessarily need with a buy now button or join now button but you may want to caption under a picture like um, if you're putting um, a picture of you and your uh, husband up uh, on there you might say you know Angie and Dwayne um, under the picture so you really don't need a caption I'm gonna put it in there just so you can see what it looks like when I uh, show you the blog and then the alternate text you just want to again name it something relevant red but red join now call to action button and I'm using call to action button because that's in my keywords and same thing with description okay the other very, very, very important thing is that you need to go down here to where it says attachment display settings and you want to go down here where it says link to if it is on media file when someone clicks on that join now button it will just go to the picture that you see so it'll just be the picture of the join now button. If you are on the custom URL then it will um, put you it will take you to the whatever website you put in there so for example I have a join now button I'm gonna put join DS Angie can help dot com join dash DS Angie can help dot com and that way when someone clicks on my join now button they'll go to my join um, DS page now I'm gonna insert it into post some I didn't say was make sure you're in text okay visual is what it actually looks like I'll show you Oh, I still have the download button in there now because uh, I was doing another video. Um, so that's what it kind of looks like. This area here is a is a video. When you go back to text, you'll see I've already uh, put a YouTube video in here so you can see what that looks like. You just go to YouTube. 
and you go to share and you pick the embed well maybe you pick the embed button right there and then you copy that and put that in your blog okay and you got to put it in the text all right so now I'm going to preview just to see what it's going to look like on my blog there's the YouTube video there's the join now and when I click on that it takes me to the join DS uh, page okay so you can see that it's working and that is it guys um, you that is how you create a call to action button and like I said you can choose anything that you want you just put whatever you want if you want to watch now okay you see how that works all right guys that's it um, guys click the link below this video if you are ready to join our team we um, do live trainings every single week for our uh, customers and affiliates uh, connect with me on Facebook and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video with someone uh, that you think it might help thanks guys make it a great day and we'll talk soon